this building was designed to be student friendly and also worker friendly. And one of the most lovely features about it is if you walk around the space and just look at the attention to detail in terms of light that comes through the building, it's a tremendous amount of natural light that comes through the atrium. And another nice feature is if you look around that these could be big cavernous spaces, but instead just a lot of detail to carving out space within space. And if you think about how academia works, it's all about conversation and exchanging ideas. So having places where people can come together and study, talk about ideas. In addition, on each floor there are lovely student lounge areas, so at each end of the atrium and then in some of the corners of the buildings that are set up as just sit down, hang out, talk. There are some have tables, some are just chairs, but really to facilitate interaction um, with colleagues for students and faculty. It was developed well beyond anything we would have thought. There's plenty of room for students. The technology in these rooms is remarkable. The 3D classroom, the distance education classroom, the visual uh, aspects of the HD and the sound system in the, the large uh, lecture hall. Uh, I think this area is astoundingly student-friendly related to that and very focused on the education of the students. It's interesting, I mean they did go with top-of-the-line technology in terms of the 3D classroom and its new 3D technology. We also have downstairs an EEG lab, it's really an ERP lab, uh, one of the most sophisticated ones in the Rocky Mountain region. There are rooms with one-way mirrors that we use to train students working um, in counseling and learning uh, therapeutic techniques. We're a gold lead building, which we should be proud of this building being a, a gold lead building. The University Facility Fee Advisory Board, or UFAB as we were called, uh, when this building was designed, the architects did attend several of our meetings and we had a lot of input as far as the design and what we thought the students would like. In the early discussions with what students needed to have ready access to technology and so the libraries invested in um, laptop checkout. It's very convenient for students to be able to tap into the wireless network here in the, the building, sit here and study, perhaps have a cup of coffee, eat lunch, talk with a colleague, talk with a friend. I think one of the most exciting aspects of the building um, is really sort of the investment in academic synergy, if you will, of two departments from two different colleges coming together, both people-oriented disciplines. I think that the opportunities are really limitless here and really is just an exciting factor of this building.